Hello everybody, Hooded Cobra Commander 788 here. We are still in Cobra Convergence 6, and every week I have asked you to join the Convergence by creating your own Cobra content. And every week, more people have joined. If you would like to join Cobra Convergence, just make your own Cobra creations and go to hcc788.com for instructions. Now let's see what diabolical schemes Cobra is up to this week little kind of review of these and also showing off why I really like them which will have to do with Transformers I swear so with that being said let's just dive right into it okay so the Jada diecast minifigure set from or the G.I. Joe one specifically included six figures there were Duke and Snake Eyes as previously touched upon but this is Cobra Convergence we can't talk about those guys so we're just going to cover the four Cobras. So from left to right, we got Destro, Cobra Commander, Storm Shadow, and the Baroness. Kind of the big four. Uh, yeah, these are good good condition. There doesn't seem to be uh, cracks in the elbows or anything. Yeah, they look like they've never seen the light of day, so they're all in, in good, good condition. E7, Cobra Contributor. Have technique, supportage. Birthplace, bridges from all over the world. Cobra soldier is not a unique noun. Superior, it is a general term for the members of the Cobra who have combat skills. So it's been a while since I've reviewed a G.I. Joe classified series figure. The last time I did it was version two of Scarlet. That's right, the redeco that fixed a lot of the nerfness of the first version of the figure. And in this one, we're gonna be looking at a Cobra figure because it is Cobra Convergence. So we're gonna look at a figure I just got in the other day, and that is the Cobra Battle Android Trooper or BAT. And this is a classic inspired figure, so it's really cool to get this in the classified line. So we're gonna open this figure up and take a look at it. We do have the figure visible with all the accessories included. This is a pretty close translation to the original Series 5 G.I. Joe Real American Hello, Hero figure. Hello, Hero Joe. This is my channel review of the figures of G.I. Joe. This week will be an episode special. We will participate in the event global known as the Cobra Convergence. Una iniciativa creada por uno de los mejores youtubers de G.I. Joe, el genial Hooded Cobra Commander 788. Desde acá enviamos un merecido agradecimiento por permitirnos ser parte de este evento tan importante para todos nosotros, los fans de G.I. Joe. Esta semana revisaremos la figura de Firefly, el saboteador. Firefly aparece por primera vez en el número 24 del cómic de Marvel, de junio de 1984. Big wheels, sir, and big missiles, sir. Are we forgetting anything? Big snakes, perhaps? Speaking of which, where'd they get to? Hello everybody, Sparkster1701 here. Now we're taking a look at our set of land vehicles for the Cobra yeah, Convergence. Really cool marketing gimmick where um, for the first time you could remove Destro's mask and actually see his face. Um, I bought this brand new on eBay so we could unbox it. I'm gonna unseal it in a moment, but let's just take a quick look at the box. Okay, first and foremost, we got our four flag points on the bottom. Uh, on the front here, it's going to say 12 inch tall, fully poseable Cobra figure, specially numbered collector's edition, realistic battle uniform and real metal snake tags, authentically styled battle weapons, specialized combat manual. Uh, 
Thank you to everyone who participated. If you would like to be featured in a video like this, go to hcc788.com to find out how and to see a full calendar of presenters this month. I'll see you again next week as we wrap up another amazing year of Cobra Convergence. I will see you then, and until then, remember only Cobra is Cobra.